Hi everyone, I just wanted to put together a fairly quick update and shout out video as I've been collecting up ideas and people I would like to give props to for a while. First of all, the PSP Vault series will be continuing for a little while. I will probably take a break after 12 episodes like I am going to with PS2 Tuesdays and call that the first season. I will most likely then replace it with something else for a little bit, but it will come back. PS2 Tuesdays Season 1 will be ending this week, but I am already planning the second season. I'm going to be making some improvements, including much bigger footage of the games and HD footage if the game has had a re-release on the 360 or PS3. If you have any suggestions of games I could cover, please let me know. I have been intending to bring back Commodore Classics for a while now, though I would like to change the format a bit. Instead of one game per video, I would like to make a show of up to 30 minutes long. This won't be weekly though as it's simply too much work. I don't have an ETA for the first episode yet, but I have started putting this together for it. The rest of the ideas here are subject to change, as I think I've been getting quite ambitious already. GBA Days will probably replace PS2 Tuesdays for a bit, and it will be mini reviews of the GBA games that have been released on the Wii U. Then, I have been meaning to make videos to go with some of my older reviews on my blog, and also write and film some new ones for games like Skyrim, for example. There is not a fixed schedule for these, just as and when I find time to put them together. The same thing goes for the Wii Hidden Gems articles I've already written. I would like to make videos to go with them. Then I would like to start making new ones, and also Wii Essentials articles and videos, like I intended to all along. Finally, I would like to do something special for reaching 100 subscribers, should I ever get there. A giveaway or something like that. I've probably got a while to think about this as new subs are a bit slow going at this early stage. That's it for the channel updates, now it's time for a few shout outs to some deserving YouTubers. First up we have Dapper Duck, who really helped me out recently by designing my channel art and logo for free. The banner I had put together myself was a bit lame, and the new one looks really great. I've already had several subs since I changed it over which I think is at least partly down to the channel looking more professional. Go and check out this channel for funtage and shenanigans in various games, including FIFA 14. Next we have a chap who goes by the name of Gambit190. He's a big comics fan and also enjoys retro video games, so his channel is full of information and reviews on both. He's also not afraid to show his face on camera, unlike me. The next channel is called Craighead Productions. This is mainly commentary on news from around the game industry, and the topics he chooses are very interesting and sometimes a little controversial. The final channel I would like to mention is one I have just recently discovered, Retro Liberty. They make a show called The NES Pursuit, where they go to local swap meets and thrift stores in search of gaming bargains. It's quite similar in format to another popular YouTube show called The Game Chasers, where hosts Aaron and Ricky manage to put their own personality and style into it so it's not just a clone. That's it for now, quite a lot to get through. Stay tuned for the final episode of PS2 Tuesdays Season 1 in a few days time and then watch out for the start of something new.